ladies and gentlemen, today we are installing Windows 11. Oh. And there we have MS DOS. Because we pressed F F12. <gasps> Windows 11! Well, that booted easily. Alright, well that's successfully booted. Well, the little spinny thingy appear. Extremely modern. Beautiful. Oh, there it is! The spinny thingy! Oh my god, it feels so good. Alright. Uh, now we enter setup. Let's just click next. Install now. Ooh, beautiful. Setup is starting. Got the little tiny clock. <gasps> ah! I accept. Upgrade. Never mind. No. Got one! Hooray! Or, never mind. Now we're gonna see what happens if we install with this driver. Hopefully it doesn't fail. Because! I remember installing Windows 11 on this thing. I, I didn't make a video of it, sadly. And it failed. So let's see with this bad boy. Does it make it? Oh, I made it. Getting files ready for installation. So, this thingy does not support Windows 11 because the Intel Core is an i5 V Pro. And for this one, it has an Intel Core i5 8th Gen which runs Windows 11. So, and yes, and we are installing this from USB. Right now, it's doing perfectly right now. I'll pause the video because I don't want you guys to literally see this upgrading Windows 11. Let's, let's just say our final words to Windows 10. Even though we probably might not. Goodbye Windows 10, you lived a good life. Even though it's not even 2025. It's almost done. Oh, that, oh, no, 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 that was fast. I guess it did work on unsupported hardware. Just installing ding darn up. Oh, Windows needs to restart to continue. I am not gonna click that button. <sighs> My boot from the corner. Uh oh, and it's dead. All right, we got the good old modern thingy. I don't like when the boot screen is so fat. Uh oh. Okay, now, oh my. So the only problem is it booted from the USB, which brought us back to the first part of startup, setup. Now it's back to where it's supposed to be. Now Windows 10 is removed. It's been a good time with Windows 10. Sadly, it's been upgraded. I mean, the reason why we upgraded is because it's about to expire next year. So that's why we upgraded. So, remember, this hard drive does not support Windows 11. Thanks to a file from this YouTuber, I'll link him down in the comments. Shout out to that guy for the Windows 11 bypasser file. Yeah, he helped us make Windows 11 thanks to his tutorial. Shout out to him, I forgot his channel name. 
I did check earlier. And yeah, it's getting ready. I'll, I'll, I'll pause and then resume when something disappears. Okay, it rebooted somehow. Uh, oh, hey! This is not Windows 10. Guess we installed Windows 10 again. <gasps> oh my lord. Let's connect to a network. This is our network. Okie dokie, we got it ready. Oh my god, bro. Well, it's incorrect. Second time. It worked. Now let's click on next. Checking for updates. Let's name your device. Okay, I named this computer Epic Computer. Wait, hold on, let me change it. Windows 11 PC. Click next. Oh, no numbers. Okay, the, the screen just turned black and then turned this. Next. Just a moment. Think what happened? The screen automatically resolution. So that we don't get stuck with the big fat giant thingy. And there it is, it reboots once again. Enter sleep mode, not anymore. Just a moment. Okay, we're back. Little loading screen. How would you like to set up this device? Personal use? Now let's sign in. Now that's finished. I don't know if it's gonna ask for a second account. There it is. So now this is definitely not mine. Now, there's a backup. There's a backup. Interesting. Let's restore from this bad boy. Restoring, restoring, restoring. Now this computer it was the Windows 10 computer that we that we shouted removed. So yes. Oh, it finished. Create a pin. Okay, that was easy. I don't know. Okay. Okie dokie. Use your Android phone. We're gonna skip that for now. Not now, because we have Chrome. No, we don't want Microsoft Edge. No, we don't want cloud storage, because I don't know. We don't want Game Pass because that literally cost ten dollars. Thought it was gonna cost only a dollar. Again, it's checking. Oh my God. Okay. Uh. Okay. Whoa. Oh my God. Oh my God. This is so cool. from Windows 10 to 11 on an 
unsupported hardware. But that's not the end of the video because we have to add my profile because it's someone else's. So yeah. Okay. Oh, that's me. Sign in. Just a moment. Now I get that. Okay. Enter with my password. Create a pin. Yes, I want a pin. Just a moment. Well, oh, oh, oh! Welcome. Hi. Getting things ready for you. This might take a few minutes. There we have it again. The beautiful. Or. Oh. Next. I said next. Good. I don't want Microsoft 365. Nope. There we go, boys. There it is. So we successfully installed Windows 11. Oh my god. I already missed Windows 7. No, 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 not Windows 7. Windows 10. I mean, Windows 10 lasted for a few minutes. Well, not minutes. Lasted for a year. Double check. Winver. There it is, boys. Windows 11, 23H2. Version 23H2. Nope, not 22H2. 23H2. Well, people, I guess this is the end. If you like this video, be upgraded to Windows 11. Make sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in Saturday or Sunday. Goodbye.